Good evening. This is the Comic Book Shop of Doom, and I'm your host. This is the nightly news for Tuesday, June 2nd, 2020. If you're under 13 years of age, get your parents' permission to watch this video. I keep it clean, but I don't want to get a, a fine from COPA, YouTube, or the government. So if you want to watch this video, get your parents' permission. Watch it with them if possible. If not, don't watch this video. How do you like my new Jawa shirt? Recycle your droid, save the galaxy. I got this online from QWERTY. It's a British site. It was 9 bucks, so it was pretty cool. All right, this is all your comic book wrestling and movie news for Tuesday, June 2nd, 2020. Kurt Angle, WWE offered him a deal where they wanted him to manage Matt Riddle, so he turned that down, reasons unknown. Evan Peters, he was in the X-Men movies, he was Quicksilver, he's been cast in WandaVision, the Scarlet Witch and um, the Vision series that's going to be on Disney+, Plus. so people are thinking that maybe he's going to be Quicksilver on there. Okay, Marvel regains the rights to Daredevil in six months from Netflix. They had some deal where they couldn't use him for two years, and it's the same with all those characters, the Punisher... Luke Cage, uh, Jessica Jones, Iron Fist. What happened was it was two years from the date that they canceled it, so Daredevil was the first show to go. So in six months, Daredevil is able to be activated and used in movies, TV, anything Marvel wants to do with him. Okay, Newsarama. This was a good site. Um, I haven't gone to it recently a lot because I kind of could see it was dying off. Well... It's been integrated into this other company called Games Radar. So they shut down and abandoned their website URL and their archives have been wiped out. So all those years of comic book uh, updates and stuff gone. The ad market is in down in the gutter, so that's what happened. And their parent company just put them in as a section on a gaming site called Game Radar Plus or something. Okay, the real Godspeed is going to show up in The Flash Season 7 to fight Barry Allen. Okay, there's an auctioning house that's auctioning off. They, they, I never knew they made this. There was a Batwoman movie. It's a Turkish movie. So the old deal with the old Turkish movies is they were always ripoffs of American movies. There's a Turkish Star Wars out there. Watch that. It's funny. It might even be on YouTube. But there's a Batwoman movie, and they have a poster for it, and it's for sale. So it's they actually, you know, they would go and make these movies without having the rights to them, and they just show them in Turkey. And then they would leak out to other parts of the world and all that. Okay, New Japan Pro Wrestling has filed a trademark on Wrestle Dynasty. AWA Studios, that's the Bill Jemis company, the newest comic book company, Okay, they signed with Diamond. They've released a handful of books since um, before the pandemic hit. They released a handful of books, the pandemic hit, and they're starting to put out books again. So these guys got an investment from uh, one of Rupert Murdoch's sons. He's the backer of this company. Okay, the Justice League Zack Snyder cut has more nightmare footage in it. Batman where he's looking over the devastated world and he sees the apocalypse symbol. So there's more of that coming. Hellraiser star Doug Bradley is launching a YouTube channel. So he was Pinhead. So good for him. He's doing like poetry readings and book readings on there. Okay, the WWE, their network, they launched a free tier on there today. So go to WWE.com and you can log in there. Create an account, and you can watch free stuff. And then if you want to watch the other stuff, you have to pay. And then WWE is cutting the pay for producers and referees, you know, to stem the pandemic losses, and it's rumored to be 20%. Everybody have a good night.